Hi, I'm Jake, and welcome to another Rig Rundown. Today, we're talking about the Sherwood 14-inch heavy-duty bandsaw. The 14-inch heavy-duty bandsaw is a real workshop all-rounder. It's designed mostly for your smaller professionals, say two to three guys set up, and it comes with the five-year manufacturer's warranty as standard. Let's take a look at the features. So you've got your 14 inch cast iron wheels. You've got your quick release tension and tension adjustment lever up the top here. You've got your height adjustment here, uh, including ceramic bearings, which should keep your blade cooler, which means your blades will stay sharper for longer. So this bandsaw is packed with features. And apart from the motor, where it really shines is its cast iron top. So let's go through that now. It's got a solid cast iron top with two mitre tracks in it at a standard 19mm wide. It has a quick change blade release to keep you working for longer. And it has a heavy duty rip fence. Alright, now let's take a look down below. So you've got your other 14 inch wheel down below. You've also got a hard wide brake pedal, so if you need to stop it and walk away. You've also got dual four inch dust ports, which allows for better dust extraction. Blade capacity is between six to 25 millimeters, so it's good for cutting tight curves if you need to, and it's also capable of resawing with a wider blade, also if you need to. The cutting height itself is approximately 345 millimetres and the cutting throat is approximately 335 millimetres. So you've got a lot of space to work with. Now the motor itself is a 240 volt, two horsepower motor. Uh, it is run off 15 amp power, so you will need to get your Sparky out to take a look if you, if you don't have the capacity yet. The last feature I want to talk about is the power board just down here. Now your apprentice may not know what this is, so let me explain it to you. You've got the power light button here that will indicate that there is power running to the machine. You've got your go button, your stop button, and that's all you need to know. And that's it for another video. So if you need any more information, just click the links below. Like, share, and subscribe to the page to help us grow. And I'll see you in the next video.